Hey, it's me, Pro Jared. Welcome back to Sprung, a game where everyone scores. I have yet to score, but now I need to set up a date with Leanne. Leanne's a cutie. Uh, that was not the music I was expecting. You are the victorious alpha male of your peer group. Leanne grabs your arm before you leave the club. Hey there, Shug. The scene in the VIP room was too limp for me. You can go ahead and take this back. Uh, uh, P.S. I've been thinking about you while I was up there. Why don't you meet me in the hot tub, darling? Say one hour. Yes. Ta-ta for now, darling. Just make sure you bring me something sweet, Shug. Dude! Dude! You are awesome! Leanne is all the hot lodge gossip. Ask her about Erica. Find out if Erica's into me, will ya? Which one's Erica? Good idea, dude. Find the best way for you to hook up with that Alex chick, too. Dude, take this. It always helps me in a pinch. You have received the magic bandana. Okay. Um. What the hell is this? Oh, uh, sorry. I need that. You no longer have the magic bandana. <laughs> tell her this. How can you tell if a hippie has been in your house? Oh. He's still there. I think I hate this. It works every time. <laughs> Thanks. Dude, shut up. Brett, Leanne loves jokes. Tell her this one. What goes stop, go, stop, go, stop, go? What? A blonde and a flashing red light. Dude, that's so old. Don't use that, Brett. Okay. The second you enter the hot tub area, Leanne jumps on you. Get the gossip for your boys. And a little something for yourself while you're at it. How long do you plan on making me wait? Um... Come on, don't be like that. Excuse me there, Shug. I'll be like however I'm feeling, got it? So did you bring me something sweet like I asked you to? Sure did. Chewing gum? I got chewing gum. Yeah. This music is, is fuck music. There's no other way to describe it. Okay, uh, sure did. What do you got, darling? Ah. Uh, did, did you ask me for something? I declare, Brett, it's a wonder that you've gotten this far. Yeah. You, when you asked me to bring something sweet, I thought you meant me. Well, I'm glad you think so highly of yourself. Brett, I'm sorry if I'm being a little witchy, but I'm a hypoglycemic. Do you know what that means? Sure. Good, then you know that my blood sugar gets low if I don't eat regularly and can make me a little mean. And I can't hang out in the spa when I'm like this, otherwise I'll pass out. So I was hoping you brought me some candy or something. I don't think they sell candy here. That hippie chick Shauna always has weird little treats. If you can get some for me, I know you. Big time. Oh, I got her number. Big time. Go get Shauna and move on. There she is, Miss Hippie Snowbird Mountain herself, sitting under a tree. Brad, I know you'd feel me contacting you. I think you and I are fated to connect with one another. Are you interested in making contact with me, Brett? Uh, yes. The only way I can open myself up to another person is if he is willing to experience a guided meditation with me. Let's do it. I'm just concerned about my horticultural display. My toadstools have died. Would you mind asking Erica for her fun guess? Yeah. Without a batch of toadstools for good luck, the ceremony won't work. And I want to succeed in touching you, Brett. And if you do this for me, I will connect to us as one and give you all of the karma melts you want. Go see Erica! I did it. This is weird. Erica really, really likes you. Be careful. She freaks out easily. You have to get Erica's fungus. Yep. Oh, you're Erica. That's right. Brett, what are you doing here? Hang on. Don't touch my hands. Oh, yeah. They smell like fish again. <laughs> so how are you? Becky's in here. If that's who you're looking for. Uh, I need your fungus. Brett, please. We're in a public place. Of course, if you want to go somewhere, I could take a break. I hear it only takes 15 minutes.
There's not a single one. Was she just offered to bang me? Why isn't there one? She'd be like, yes. I'm supposed to get laid, right? That's my whole point here. All right, you grow toadstools, right? If Sneaky Kiki sent you here to make fun of me, you can stop right now. Uh, I need some kind of toadstools to, for Leanne, kind of. I'll sell them for $949. I don't have that. That wouldn't happen to be a uh, um, raw fish smell in your pants, would it? I mean, I I did just happen to get some raw fish. And I guess she's into that. Uh, give me some toadstools, I'll give you the fish. But these toadstools are like my babies. Uh... I'll, I'm trying to... I don't think I can hit on her. I'm sure we could work something out. Are you talking about hooking up? I am now? No, I'm not talking about sex. I'm talking about my fungus. Maybe I could hook you up with someone. Or maybe I... Are you interested? I might be. Are you? I might be. Take my phone number. Oh, no, wait. I wrote it down wrong. Here, this is right. The wrong number on my own phone. Ha ha ha. Tight. And hey, Brett, take the toadstools, but only if you promise that you'll call me. Got it. You're the best, Brett. Call me. Congratulations. You get back to Shana before Leanne passes out. <laughs> like, that's meant to be a Mario pose, right? Brett, the Yeti said you might need this. You received the hay. Nail it. Save it again. Can you keep it up between Leanne and Shauna? You're going to have to seduce Shauna if you want to get your hot top freak on with Leanne. All right. Let's go. You return to the nature trail. Brett, have you brought something for me? Uh, yeah, I got your good luck token. Well, present it to me and we'll begin the journey. Uh, use... Toadstools. I no longer have the toadstools. I'm okay with that. Ah, beautiful, beautiful, Brett. You got them perfect. I'm so happy. Now with my lucky horticultural token, my garden will be perfect, Brett. Thank you. Uh, what did we do? Patience, Brett, patience. Just close your eyes now and breathe. Breathe. Breathe, and now we'll begin, Brett. I need you to prove your worth to my company by opening yourself for me. Oh my god. This just became like one of those creepy creepypasta.exe games. Um, how do I do that? Come with me and I'll promise, no, I promise you won't be disappointed. I can't let a man enter my inner sanctum without knowing that he can handle himself well. And for each of the three trials that you pass, Brett, I'll give you a piece of my candy. You got it. First, we will test your intuition and ability to read body language. Based on my pose, tell me what emotions you see. Let's get started. Remember, interpret my body language and recall my mood oh, in the correct order. I'm doing this again. What is this? Uh, anger. Next round. Here's my first. You, grr. Disgust, anger. Next round. Mmm, ha, mmm. Um. Suspicion, laughter, attraction. Next round. Laughter, disgust, suspicion, anger. What was that? What was the first one already? I forgot. Uh. Suspicion. Damn it, I already forgot. No, anger. Anger. I, I, I gotta start at the beginning. Anger. Disgust. Anger. Alright. Suspicion. Laughter. Attraction. Suspicion. Laughter. Attraction. Laughter. Disgust. Suspicion. Anger. Why are you crying? I haven't done anything yet. Suspicion. Fuck! I forgot, dude! No, you didn't say that. Liar! Oh, fuck. Uh, sorry, I said the wrong thing. Alright, alright. Yeah, let's just... 
Alright, same thing. It's a fucking game. Okay. Yeah, we're breathing. Creepy pasta. Okay. Got it. Anger. Yes. Then it goes disgust. Oops, I hit A too fast. Fuck. Anger. Disgust. Anger. Yep. Then it's suspicion. Laughter. Attraction. I don't know why this last one was so hard for me. Okay. Laughter. L. D. S. Angie. L. D. S. Angie. Okay. Attraction. Suspicion. A S. At S L. D. At S L D. Angie. At S L D. Angie. Nailed it. Oh, that was good. That was really, really good. Now, Brett, that's impressive. Like I promised, here you are. Candy. Skittles? I'm impressed with your emotional awareness, Brett. Shall we move on to the second trial? But I've got a... I got a spa thing at the be at, and like she's gonna die or something. Sorry! I don't even say bye. It looks like you're going to have to manage between two women at once, Brett. Every man's dream, right? You head straight back to the hot tub for, to pump her for gossip. Brett, I'm sorry. I have to cancel. I'm feeling so weak. Suck candy. Is that? You no longer have the candy. So good. Just give me a second, Brett. Thank you, Brett. Oh my gosh, I feel so much better. Now I can give you my undivided attention. Uh, why would I say this? Ever. Okay, uh... You had me pretty worried there. Uh, don't you worry about me, hon. No big deal. Okay. Um... I'm glad you stopped me before I left the club. Yeah, I was sick of getting hit on by that tool, Elliot. I don't know who that is. He thinks that just because he's rich, he can get anyone. Oh, that guy? I bet you get hit on a lot. Why do you say that? You seem a little hardcore. Ah. Uh, that's the word. Rawr. Uh, okay. I'm supposed to get that gossip. Heard any good gossip? I knew you weren't just interested in my southern hospitality. You want some dirt, huh? Okay, so I was supposed to... Was I supposed to ask about all of them? No, I wasn't supposed to ask about all of them, was it? No. Alex was the blonde-haired lady? Yeah. She's mine's tough chickadee. You should tell that boy Lucas of yours that she loves music. Got it. And then... Erica was the... I definitely got something on her. Oh, I'm feeling spell coming on. Are you... Do I have to go back and... Get more... I have to get more candy, don't I? And then I run back to here. Uh, okay. Imagine yourself an animal. Picture your own connection with the natural world. Accept your animal spirit. What do you see, Brett? <laughs> See it, Brett? Oh. I see it. Moo? You receive the golden line for notebook, Brett. Moo. Okay. I see something. Brett, I want you to pretend that I am not the Earth Tempter, Shauna. Pretend that I am a strange beast and seduce me. I want you to moo me. I mean, woo me, Brett, with your tools of sight, touch, sound, smell, and taste. We're on a first date. What would be the correct order of sensual moves to make? Well, I don't think it's... I'm not kissing this cow. Your hands are very soft. 
You've told her she has soft hands like baby hands. Now what? You smell fantastic. You've told her she smells like crushed lavender petals exploding from vanilla bean pods. Now what? I'm going in! You have ravished her with your lingual caress? Now what? Uh, why are you, what, uh, look great. Damn it. Yeah, I'll try again. I don't understand. I'm just looking at this cow face. Okay. What's the order? Wow, you look great. Uh, what I heard you say is very fascinating. Dan's hands are soft. Smell fantastic. Yep, should have kissed last. Yes, very good. Here you go. You definitely earned this one. Are you ready for the final trial? Ah, uh, I gotta go. Hey, oh, I'm feeling a spell coming on. Have some more Skittles. All right, now where were we? Uh, I already asked about Alex. I tried to ask about Erica, but she started passing out. So let's, let's try that again. That girl has no dirt, except for the fact that she spends an awful lot of time throwing dead fish into the woods. Kiki? Fuck. And that's why the devil invented staplers. Already in progress, she didn't even notice you leave. And now, we shall enter the final test, Brett. One of sensitivity, Brett. The key component to connecting with a partner. I want you to look into my eyes, Brett. And give me what I want. Oh, oh, I got, you want hay, you're a cow. Moo! Uh-uh, she kisses me, hell yeah! Brett, congratulations, you're a wonderful wise spirit and I shall bestow upon you gifts from nature. You've received a wisdom stone. Want more candy? And the spirits of the earth reside in this magic image-taking box. A camera, just called it that. Uh, go get the gossip for your boys. One last thing of candy. There you go. And finally, Kiki. I hate that this lady's like, oh yeah, I'm all about the gossip. Mm. Everyone pay attention to the people around you. If you know someone who just willingly gossips about other people all the time, that means they'll be the first to drop you out of their lives as soon as they have gossip on you. I've heard her talking about you, Brett. Too bad her boyfriend, Connor, is cheating on her. Ooh. Now, Brett, let's forget about talking about everyone else. Let's get back to you and me, Shug. But all oh, this gossip in here has gotten me. And she's asleep. And dead. Oh, well, you didn't get the hookup you came here for, but you got the gossip for your boys. You sneak off and hope that nobody traces her passed out body back to you? <laughs> the cow face. I like Leanne's business suit. Oh boy. Well, bonus truth or dare? Just to get hot, let's go. Is this gonna be one of those games where like it constantly te teases something like super hot happening and then just nothing hot happening, right? It's gonna be one of those. Okay. Truth or dare time, kitties. How fun. Oh, you're both here? I'll get the person who takes the best dare prize, maybe. Alright. Uh Shana, truth or dare? Truth! Um uh, If you had to make out with one person in the room, who would it be? Probably Lucas if I had to. Booya! Oh, remember when people said booya? Don't be sad. I looked to Lucas for my physical gratification, but I looked to you for my intellectual gratification. You got the run to the deal, buddy. Can we move on, please? All right. Um, what do I do here? Uh, uh, pick me! Truth or dare? Dare? Or truth? Who do you think is the most attractive girl of the girls in this room?
Well, you were a cow. So, man? I don't know. You'd be paying for that one for months, buddy. Do your worst. Okay. Uh, oh, Leanne, truth or dare? Dare! This game's rated teen. So I kind of doubt this is gonna work. Uh, how about, um... E Entire bottle of hot sauce! That would kill me. Sugar, no problem. That there hot sauce was me in my hometown. Damn it. Damn, look at her go! This is pretty impressive, almost not human. Burp. Moving on! Uh... Pick me up. Truth or dare? Dare? Go into the other room, take your underwear off, and put them in the freezer. That's all? How's it going, Commander Brett? I get it. Don't you mean Commando Brett? Uh, the Andrew the Dare? Truth. Uh, what's the meanest thing you've ever done to someone? I did pick up a hitchhiker once, drive him to an abandoned sawmill, and kill him. I'm joking. The worst thing I ever really did was to a gentleman I was dating. I need him in the groin? That's it? Pick me! This last one needs to be an awesome dare. Alright. Fuck me up. The three confer wickedly. Ah, oh, no teamsies! We want you to take your underwear out of the freezer and put it back on. <laughs> okay. That felt pretty good, actually. Ah, uh, what? I received the cocoa. Good. Oh, an indecent proposal, rich kid Elliot has an offer for you? Get as much as you can from him without giving up Becky. Oh yeah, I was supposed to be trying to hook up with Becky in this whole game. But I kind of like her the least. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. Hold on, let me look at something. This is... This is level 10, and Brett has, like, 20? For this guy? Give or take? Yeah, I don't know. We'll keep going. Again, if you're enjoying this, you gotta let me know. Because if people aren't into it, then, you know, I won't keep playing it. I'll move on to other stuff. But, if you're enjoying it and want to see more and where this goes and see how hot and steamy this teen-rated DS game gets, we'll keep going. As always, thank you guys so very much for watching. See you next time!